we're gonna make a fairy garden today out of this cute little terrarium. Fairy gardens are right now are the cool thing to do, trend, excitement all around and little girls just love to get in here as much as moms do. I love to do it. So how we started is we took some gravel rock and we filled it up to this bottom line and then we added some a layer of charcoal and this gives it drainage so your plants don't rot and go stinky and moldy. Then I took some of this sheet moss and layered that on top of the charcoal, which that helps the soil from going down into your gravel and getting lost and washed away. So after that, we, did, we used cactus mix, which is a drier mix, so it stays a little bit less dry because your succulents, they don't like a lot of water. You're not gonna have to water them very often because they, are, they like to be dry just like when you're in the desert. So after I planted all of that up, that's when I used some more of the sheet moss and then you can use other kinds of mosses. We have colored moss that I have a little bit of this purple right here that I shoved in there. So it just gives it a little bit of color and attracts the fairies to your garden. Then, I just have this cute little house that I put in here. It looks like a little gourd and a little walkway. Added a few little animals and it doesn't take a whole lot of time to make one of these and it's really easy for kids and grandmas to do with their kid, grandkids when they come over and it's a fun little project and they can take it home and have their own little fairy garden. Also, we have these little kits here that are even easier. All you have to do is, we have a pot here that you just fill it up with dirt and some rocks. And you just take this completely out of the package and just set your different pieces around and you're done. So that's even a lot, a lot easier than other ones. We've also got little pieces in little baggies that you can create your own fairy garden. And we've got like archways and bridges and all that and you can do it in any kind of bowl, plate, it all turns out really cute. 